Hello, everybody, and welcome to another episode of Let's Play Battlefront. We'll start with Battlefront. Last time, we beat the droid campaign. Well, the droid's half, the Clone Wars campaign. In this episode, we're going to finish the other half, the Battle of Geonosis. Prevent the Separatists from leaving the surface, we must. Yes. Concentrate all firepower on the remaining Techno-Union ships. The rest of your units, to the Great Spire, send them. All right, we will. I'm going to pause it and resume it when I click launch because it will just boot up my home screen. So I found that out through the hard way. You're back. And back we are. It also boots up a movie clip, which we cannot see because, again, that is copyright. Anyways. Hey, welcome to Geonosis. With our new clone army, we have clone troopers, arc troopers, clone pilots, and clone sharpshooters. First, we're going to start off as a clone pilot because our first goal is to use one of the one of the LAATs to full. Yes, it is. And let's destroy those Techno Union ships while also providing covering fire for our units. These can also act as mini checkpoints. So if we land them, you can able to spawn, clones are able to spawn from them. Also, a fellow ship leading to ship combat in this game. Oh, Q, Q. That's how you do it. Just shoot it down, if you can. Also provide covering fire. Again, we want to win. Shoot at that, at that joint to do more damage. We also have Master Windu on our side. Who fell out of a window. Boom! You also have a limited amount of on this battle, though, what makes it hard is that there are enemy Geonosians, which are a, well, species that's allied with the with the droid army. Each of these destroyed, though, is worth a lot of, sh of, of uh, reinforcements for the Techno Union. So, basically, while they have one bonus, we have another. Okay, I'm just going to time shots. Alright, messed up there. Oops, no, I didn't mean to land it. Back. Back, get out. Nice, direct hit. But yeah, I'm gonna try to destroy these if I can. What we're supposed to do is lead those LEATs to there. Alright, but I'm going to do it the old-fashioned way of just brute forcing. Hey, Mitt Windu. Master Windu. Oh, frick! <laughs> Focus fire, destroy it. I'm going to show mainly this, and then we're going to... Ooh, someone got an LAT there! So it's being destroyed very quick. They... Yeah, that. Not LAT, the, uh... We destroyed one. I'm also going to land this here, because this is going to create a spawn point for the rest of our forces. The way that they can just walk and find and move through. Yardcaster? Yeah, this is fully guarded. And they can be used as a checkpoint, normally. Unless I blew it up. Let's destroy him. Destroy the Techno Union ships. But yeah. Just, just blow them up. Blew them up. This two. After this, our objective will be complete, and we will and we'll start progression on the main on the main force. We also swap between them in order to fire at will. Yes, sir. Right away. Boom! 
And with that soul attack medium ships down, I'm going to uh, start progressing. Because now we have full control over them, but that also means more force in respawning on the main front. Kill the 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 ocean. With a good old pistol. And let's go and in, go into the main hangar bay and take that over. Bro! Now we are losing currently, so we have to be very careful. The only problem is the clone pilot is the worst of all the pilots in the game. Because his arc his arc caster is pretty bad. Now just capture the main base. And we can just flood their thing on a double on a dual uh, attack. Hey. Oh. Hello. There we are. And that's a dead Gene Ocean. Gene Oceans use sonic guns and sonic grenades, I think. I also need to show off the other classes of the clones. Oh yeah, I forgot that all the command posts in this game are actually named, unlike the other game. So that's the Spire. Which I actually like. I don't like how they removed it, actually. Hmm. A Techno Union a missile pod ship. This is only used in this, in this area, isn't it? Why don't we just take this for ourselves and have access to a missile pod silo? Oops, I just ran over a teammate. And Bling is a droid. A Hailfire droid, to be exact, is what its name is. But hey, I'm gonna go respawn. Yeah. Which basically just kills you. Because I want to show off the, the clone classes, aka the main clone trooper. The clone trooper has a pistol. A haywire grenade, which is an electricity grenade. They don't have explosives because, you know, they don't need to. They are fighting droids. They actually need to concuss, the, to concuss them. Not concuss them, but uh, shock them and shock their circuits. Oh. Careful. Huh. Grenade out. Grenade out. Boom. Two grenades. Both work. Well, one hit, at least. Oop. Avoid you. You know, so you also have concussion grenades, which you can use. <laughs> Ding, donk. Oh, hello! Okay. Yo, yeah, we're losing! Oh god! Roll into the- roll into the spire! Roll into the spire! Where's a health pick the carrot? Uh, there. Health. Okay, we're waiting again. We managed to cut their forces down enough. I kind of like to make the sound effect for some reason. It's a, sat it's a satisfying sound effect. And as a one that I have ingrained into my memory. Also, one way to defeat those guys is to actually fall back. They follow you. Then you can just blast them out of the sky while they follow you. Hoop. They're outside of range. Smart maneuvers. Evasive maneuvers. Evasive maneuvers. Oh god. They're in the spire! They're in the spire! Sorry. Habit. Habit I have a bit when I play these games. I've <laughs> become a clone trooper. Whoa! <laughs> got shot. Hey, anyway, I gotta get kill straight though. Now let's show the arc tripper. The arc tripper has a rocket launcher. But it fires two rockets. Boom! It also homes in a bit when you're locked on. What if you actually hold a rocket launcher on an area? It homes. Boop. Boop. Boom! Defeat that guy. Gene Oceans also have lo lower health than normal uh, creatures. Because they're there to be shot very quickly. Our troopers actually have a higher range of health. We didn't know this actually, as well. Oop! Thank you for the health. Thank you for the health, fine clone. Hello, brother. I missed. That didn't. Have fun shooting the floor. Oop! Grenade out. 
Oh god. They blew themselves up. Nice job, guys. I'll show off the other, uh, the, the sharpshooter shooter and the other sharpshooter uh, in the others after this. Oh the public! Capture this fat, the last command post, and we've secured! Victory is at hand! I, well, before we just take out that guy in front of us. That's trying to shoot us with a sniper rifle. That's right. In the middle of nowhere. Heat rocket. Missed. I missed. Missed again. Yeah, we're gonna win by a command point. Which, by the way, is a very good way to win. Alright. And we win! Victory! And with four CPs caught, and also I think survivalist, which was because of me uh, camping in the thing. I know Mace Windu won public enemy because again it's Mace Windu. But I, who cannot die. But yeah. Upon Skip. Camino, our eventual victory depends. Defend against the separatist attack, or our clones will be lost. But yeah. Okay, the Separatists have launched an attack on the Camino cloning facilities. Defend the cloning facilities at all costs and make good use of our new Jet Tripper unit. That is a unit that, that, that we'll get into in a bit because I need to, to do something. So, be right back. So, I, un I unmuted the music. I wanted to see if this episode will get copyright striked. If it does, no more audio for, for music. This is a test. The test videos came out clean, so let's try it. As long as I'm talking, it should, it should count. Let's get... Our eventual victory. Also clicking back also puts it in the separatist attack, or our clones will be lost. And let's start the mission. Skip. <laughs> and let's start our mission on Camino. The planet. Where the clones are born. Defend the clone facilities and other stuff. Bloom. Now with this area, we get a new clone, the Jet Trooper. We'll show this off along with the uh the sharpshooter. Also, I'm having it on low, though, for music, so we don't have to deal with uh, a lot. But hey, we actually outnumber the enemy. That's good. But it's just enough so we have some music. But not, like, overshadowing my voice, so we don't... Yeah. This is a test. Just use... I guess using the Clone Wars TV show. The, uh... Dang, I got first kill. Pretty sure. Jet Troopers are really good. My opinion, some of my favorite clone troopers in the game are jet troopers. My favorite, clone, my favorite trooper in this game is the Imperial Jet Trooper. Or specific the, specifically the Dark Trooper. But also at distance, the, the models kind of uh, mesh into a giant blob, so... Have a the enemy forces captured anything else, I wonder. Headshot. I ain't the best sniper, just warning you. I'm gonna be doing this to show off the sniper class. I am mainly a trooper main. I can shoot still targets, though. Headshot. Pew, pew, pew. I have pizza tower music stuck in my head. Pew, pew, pew. And this what this area taken over. He's lost Alpha One. Boom! No uh, swapping classes using the E button. Then not in this game, at least. Hello. Get out of that seat. Boom. Just grab it, please. Game. Thank you. You. Let's heal up this way. I always had good luck with the Camino map. A lot of time. Ah, frick! 
And of course, I mentioned that I died. Now let's spawn as a jet trooper. Spawn at this point, so we get to actually closer. Fire a ion rocket. Because that is the gimmick of this class. They have a jetpack and rockets. They also have a really, really fast trigger pistol. Like, if you get your really fast trigger finger, good, to, good on ya. Because you can use this way better than I can. Ow! They also have very low HP. Ugh. Use the turret because they can zoom. I thought you could zoom in, but no, you cannot. Okay, that just that was worthless because they disappeared. Oh! Boom! Tracer, he strikes again. Charge the jetpack and wait for it to charge. Shoot you directly in the face. Fly up here. Skip that entire out. Yeah. I'm not the biggest fan of jet troopers myself, but I for the clones. But hey, they're losing and we're winning. I think that's a genuine design decision. They actually have clone troopers have range. Weapons have range at least. Or weapons having ranges. Well they disappear, so it makes sense. You know, because it is a rifle. Rifles in real life actually have ranges. Also, that guy fell off the tower. Ow. Also, I like the rain in this stage. Over there, that guy's piling a turret. Kill that guy. Beat our shots. They're heading into the Camino facility! That hit, I almost got him. Not enough to kill it, though. Got him. Heading into the Camino! In the Camino facility! Defend it at all costs! Ugh. I'll, I'll head in here so I can help defend the point. Shoot him dead. I do like this game. Also with EAX Audio we have, uh... Well... Sound effects. Boom. Eat that. So 1, 7.1 surround sound, baby! No dodging for you. Shoot him right in the middle of the face for maximum damage. Don't worry, they have a, they have a, they have a huge, uh... Well, deficiency on reinforcing themselves. Hold up, Poplack! Oh, hello. Get back inside because I do need health. Follow me. Follow me. Let's go. Follow me. Let's go. Oh, the public. You can actually order troops to come with you, and I got headshot right in the face. I let them all their deaths. Oops. Let's get our trooper there. With an archer, we can destroy. Eat this. I missed. Eat that. Boom! There goes a sniper down. Blown into a million bits. Bits and pieces. Roll up the stairs, because that works. So much happier with Battlefront 2's rolling. But hey. Play this game because I want to play the first game. One of my most nostalgic games of all time. And I do think it has some things better over Battlefront 2. Mainly the, the actual feel of the soldiers. I think it's better. Like with the, uh, the ability to prone, a bunch of other abilities that aren't in Battlefront 2. But yeah, we win. Shot him out, and now you have me slight. Actually, I'll adjust the music a little more because it's basically unaudible. Like 40. There we are. 
There we are. If I get muted, if I get copyright striked, eh. I'm not making money off these videos anyway. Not planning on either. Money goes to them. That's their that's their business. Listen, I've never I never did these let's plays to make money, I just wanted to do it to make content. For you guys. Never really cared about the money. In fact, I just want to get videos up on there, so it's at least a hobby. I don't know, make someone fall. Not. It's only pandering. Eat this! Eat this! I missed! Roll! Oh, hey, we win. Yay! And we win! That's a victory win. That's the end of Camino. Let's see what our awards are. Oh, uh, we've got Public Enemy. Got a hot longest kill streak. Didn't longest killing spree. Well, we got. But hey. I also got Dead Eye for seven headshots. Nice. And then we. Right the has begun to set up a long range sensor station on Renvar. <laughs> Stop them, we will. And take this station for our own use. Hmm. We discovered a separate south post on Renvar. Capture all main posts in the area. Use ice caves to flank the enemy. Oh, Renvar. Renvar, Renvar, Renvar. I like this mission. I like it a lot. Well, not this mission, but this map. The only problem is that it's very choke pointy. If you want to... If you spawn here, prepare to do nothing but fight. The fight, uh, droidicas for an hour. I'm gonna use this because I want to do something different. Head inside. Mount up! Because a lot of droidicas spawn on this map. I mean, so many that it's actually kind of ridiculous how many droidicas there are. Oops. I think I killed one of our own clone units. Hello! Ow! And that's that. Cl that sh that sh uh, ship is dead. Fire at will. Okay. Alright, I'm gonna like, head out and hit and repair. Or try to. Two more hits that I can take, the better. Okay, I'm gonna head out. And. Okay. That's dead. Let's see if I can get this outpost up. And running. Oh! No! Ugh. I'm executed. And let's spawn here. That's closer to where we're supposed to be. No! There goes the thing! Don't shoot me! Do not notice me at all! Ah, freaking notice me! It was almost dead anyway. Alright, we need to capture this command post, because if we don't capture this command post soon, we are going to lose. Yeah, we are losing forces rapidly. This mission always had trouble on. Because of, uh, you see those ice tunnels? Yeah, that's a huge choke point. Call this map choke point heaven. There we are. The top post has been captured. I mean, we can make this area a good old pushing pl place. Let's see, I just lost the lighthouse. And the old droids left their posts. Try and fight. Too bad. Because I am here. Ow! Regret. Target located. Come with me. Sir. Come with me. Fire at will. Meet shield. Go.
We need an, a forward outpost. That's the one that's not gonna be destroyed in a few seconds. That failed miserably. Chai, you dead. Ooh. Yeah, we are getting kind of shred shredded. Uh, I'm gonna spawn as you so I can destroy those turrets pretty easily. Boom, it's one down. How the heck? There. Over there. Boom. Get rid of you. Get rid of you. Boom. Hello. No, we lost our A all terrain transporter. Boom. That's another tank down. Yeah, we're getting kind of destroyed. Boom! I missed. Ugh. Arc Tripper down! Arc Tripper down! Capturing this is a good idea. Now we have two to be able to split up their forces. Again, use the ice caves. But I recommend you don't because, again, chill point. It is a good way to get there, though. It's a lot of kills. It's very hard to leave. Basically, no man's land. Oh, we, that's because it's been captured. That's why I was wondering why there's no more forces going into it. Headshot. Can we go into the ice caves and secure that for us? Hello! I got the threat kill. Hello. Ugh. Let's, let's go into here so we can get the rest of the... Let's see the main front of the clones. And let's go through here. Into the ice caves. Recapture it. So we have a two-pronged assault. Also so you can see the ice caves up close. Oh. Grenade out! Huh! Ding dong. A lot of invisible walls, too. Okay, reload. Hello. I need healing. Hulk off and hulk on an entire force of droids by myself. Yeah. Ding dunk. I got one. Father of Poplock! And we caught it! 
I fought off an entire squad of enemies by myself in order to recapture it, but I did it. Woo! Ah. Ah, we, we just lost a ton of troops. Ah, frick. I just saw us lose like seven troops in like a minute. Not a minute, like a couple seconds. And they're not dropping like flies. Instead, they're holding out pretty well. Pew! Force on two fronts! We'll force an attack on two fronts! Front and side! Huh. Don't push me out! I'll, I'll move up here. Okay, got that guy. Now, frick it, wrong time to reload. Dead. But hey, we're winning! We're winning, folks! We're winning! I, I just think these things are death traps, honestly. I'm just gonna get off that. We have them surrounded, literally surrounded. Just take him out. Sometimes using actual strategy works in this game. And boom, we win. Good game! <laughs> uh, that was a 50, that was a kill streak and a half. 31 kills and one life. Woo! And a killing spree of four. That was a freaking super match there. Wow, that guy killed his own teammates. Have launched a desperate attack on the Wookiee homeworld. We cannot allow this planet to and fall into separatist hands. We have one more mission. Defend Kashyyyk and drive the enemy off the planet. This is a battle that never happened yet. This happened in episode three. The last, this is a hint, our first hint because of like one thing that was built a lot in episode three was the battle of Kashyyyk, which is something pretty cool. But it was less of more of a background element than actually part of the film, sadly. But hey, episode three is still my favorite Star Wars film, so don't mind me. Right. Now those transitions only lead to my, to my home screen, which is instead of my Steam chat. My best friend. But yeah. Anyways. And here is a is a basically a mission of defense against the enemy tanks while you have a beachhead. You ever want to experience D-Day? Well, here's how you experience it in this game. Also, but um, but your benefit is you have a, you have the Wookiees on your side. You know, building up to what happened between the fir in the first mission. Also, really cool weight reflections in the water. Defend the Kashyyyk! Defend Kashyyyk, or Kashyyyk, whatever you pronounce it. I pronounce it Kashyyyk, but that's any. You can also reload while you have your pistol out, just one you. Let me know. Switching to your pistol is always faster than reloading. But how about switch reloading and switching to your pistol? Ah, frick, they caught it. Nope, oh, sorry, Wookie. Headshot. Again, lighter armor, lighter armor. I should have pushed, it should have been. Again, that face plate's supposed to be their headshot area, but. Yeah, what can you do? Let's head onto the one of the side areas, see if we can get a, uh, a good push. I'm gonna crouch. And I got headshot. Hey, yeah, but I got two of them. So was it a loss? Yeah, it was two for one clone. 
Again, this is why I'm a, I'm a, I'm a rifle main. Huh. For the clone army! Use your your cover, aka the lamppost. Huh. A shot in the side. Ow. That had to hurt. Boom. Now, if you want, you can actually circle around these and get better sniping position on the rest of the map. Ow. If you wanted to. What the heck? Oh. I see. Yeah, you got a kill, though, with the grenade. Now, how I've always won this is just war of attrition it. Just keep killing uh, droids until one of you wins. But, hey. Ah! Then, my character fell off the bridge. You know, cinematic style. Cinematic death shot. Hang on! What are you doing there? There's a guy behind our base! I know it's AI, but still. Get out! The sniper behind us! Two snipers! Three! And a couple snipers and a, cl and a clone trooper. Not a clone trooper, a, uh, a, a super battle droid. Get out! Follow me, come with me. I need cover fire. <laughs> that missed. You have to really lob them, which is the thing in this game. Battlefront 2, that would have that would have hit certainly. But hey, I'm sorry I keep comparing it. Just, I have played a lot more Battlefront 2 recently. It is one of the only games on Steam I have over a thousand hours on. It's kind of hard for me not to compare them when I'm used to the physics of one game and I've been playing another. Oh, hello. Guys, pursue! Ah! Oh. No, my trooper. My ban. My main man. You will be missed. Oh, you got to be Kami. That's why I hate Dronicus. Just letting you know this, I hate Droidicas. Oh. oh! I was doing so well! Oh crap! This is a waste of life. I see the one scene from the Clone Wars where like, they're wearing the ponchos. Uh, by the way, from whatever I mentioned the 2003 series. Where I shoot down from this. I don't know why. By the way, that series is awesome. The, uh, the one made with Samurai Jack. It's, uh, team. I keep forgetting who his name is, but... The guy made Samurai Jack. He made a Clone Wars TV show in 2003 to build up Episode 3. To show what the Clone Wars is like. It's now decanonized, thank you, Disney. But, seriously, I hate the absolute wiping of old canon, but Disney did. Because, first, I didn't mind it, but then I realized how many of my favorite stories are Legends ones, and. Yeah. And it really didn't need to be made, it just made a story with that world. And a lot of what the new story has been doing is canonizing the old one. Which you didn't, you didn't need to do, you just didn't canonize it. But I, I still think there's things to enjoy about both canons. Like I like their, uh, well, like the Mandalorian for the for the new Disney stuff. And it could have worked in old canon. Oh. 
the only thing it wouldn't have worked with was the Dark Troopers, and that's it. This was created by, by a different person. I hope they actually brought them back, though, to the Mandalorian, though. Okay. I'm gonna go and get myself a, uh, a Jet Trooper, so I can just... Oh, what the heck are you doing here? What are you doing there? <sighs> I spawned in and there was a guy in front of me. Shoot you. Hello! Nah! Boo! Oh god! Fly away! Roll, roll! Oh! Out of ammo. Frick. Oh, they also help with extra grenades if you really want to. Ugh. All right, sharp super, shoot, sharp super. Keep calling him that, sharp super. I swear I don't have a speech impediment. I swear. Sometimes. Don't you go for our turrets? Oh, they're attached to our base. I found the turrets. Where do you? Finally. Oh, I should probably, I should probably use this. My favorite part of this of the troopers, well, of any of them. Ah, and I messed up by shooting it. Well, I have another one. Dude, 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 dude. Have fun. Boom! And I missed. Orbital bombardment missed. How'd you miss an orbital bombardment? We're winning! Oh, they're not public! Oh. Boom! That guy blew up. Nice. We're winning, guys! We're winning! I really should host a multiplayer game. I do a multiplayer live stream, find the code in the description, and then just, uh... Do like a live uh, battle one day. Heck, maybe for this game. Why did I do this? Pew. Okay, let's capture this while the enemy has been weakened severely. Okay. And yeah, it's Droidica. Have fun with that. With the grenades I just planted by your feet. Reload that off, off in my other harp. Hold the front line! Front line's been taken! Push! I'm about to die. Oh. Ugh. Boom. Okay, just take him out. Take him out, guys. Your caster means nothing to them. Boom. There's way more than seven of these guys left. Ignore the fact I'm missing all those shots. Oh my god. That's hip fire at that point. I guess the last guy is over on the other island.
Probably fun fact that you blow up a grenade in the water. There should be a bunch of dead fish. Cool. We'll detail. I like about these games. Time for swimming. There's always the one guy in this map that always wins. Oh, Lee escapes. Mm, I hear shooting. Oh, there you are. Nope, it's dead. And hey, that's the end of the clone campaign. <laughs> 69 kills. With self getting public enemy and killing spree. And survivalist, too. Traitor is Gamma. Darn you, Gamma. And that's the end of... That's the end of the Clone Wars campaign. I had to skip the ending because if I did, I'd be copyright striked. But hey, that's the end of this. Next one, let's play... Uh, next one, let's play... Battlefront. Let's start with Battlefront. We'll be heading into the, the Galactic Civil War campaign. See you guys then. Have a great day. Bye-bye.